Welcome back to Left Coast Pops. Today we're opening up four mystery boxes from Poptopia. Stick around and let's see what we get. All right, everybody, like I said in the intro, today we're opening up four mystery boxes from our friends over at Poptopia. As you guys know, they're my favorite mystery box company. Why? Because they tell you everything you could possibly get in these mystery boxes. This one is the uh, surprise, it's Thursday mystery box. I bought these so long ago and they've kind of been sitting in the corner of my house. And to be honest, I kind of forgot that I had them. But uh, here we are, we're opening them up today and uh, here's a couple pictures of the grails that you can get in uh, these boxes. Roll it! Alright guys, so no need to waste your time anymore. Let's crack this baby open right here. So I need my trusty box cutter. Why am I dropping box cutters, man? Do it over! I found it, don't worry. I know you guys were concerned. I was concerned too. I was like, thought it was gone forever. But let's crack this thing open real quick. Take a look at uh, the whole situation here. As always, nice and wrapped up. Poptopia doesn't uh, do any spoilers. Except for when they put those papers in there, guys. So if we got papers, I'm throwing them away. Why, because we do no spoilers on this channel. Everything's legit, right? So here we go, number one, right here, nice and wrapped up. Crack this baby open. Let's hope I find the right side this time. Man, these things are difficult sometimes. Oh, I pulled this off. This is, uh, what number is that? Is that 20? I think it's a 20. Well, there you go. This is box number 20, I think. All right, let's take a look here. You guys can watch me pull this out. Front. Oh, this is the back. All right, cool. There it is. All right, cool. We got Betty Boop. Oh, the Entertainment Earth exclusive Betty Boop and Pudgy. This one's in a black and white colorway. Pretty cool. Uh, like I always say, I love that they send them in these really cool shields. So, uh, and you guys know, I'm a sucker for the cute little secondary pop there, the little extra guy. And it helps that it's a little pupper, little doggo. So, very cute. Love this one, uh, and honestly, I think this one's sticking around in the collection. Betty Boop is adorable, and, uh, you know, like I said, exclusives are fun, and the secondary pop is always a good time. So, Betty Boop with Pudgy. Entertainment Earth, Entertainment Earth exclusive is our first one. Second pop, here we go, guys. Nice and wrapped up, as always. All right, let's try to find the front and the back. Here's our back there, all right, trash. There it is. All right, Venomized Captain America. I actually already have this guy. So if anybody needs this one, uh, let me know and we'll get a trade going. I love this collection, the Venomized collection, it's super rad. They recently announced the second ones that are coming out. Uh, I think there's like a Rocket Raccoon and a Groot. There's a bunch of different ones, so it's pretty cool. Uh, my, my personal favorite from this collection, I don't have. But it is the uh, Venomized Black Panther. I also really like the Venomized uh, Iron Man just because of the cool little flames that he has coming out of uh, coming out of his hands. It's a pretty cool sculpt. But yeah, Venomized Captain America. Not too mad about that one in box number 69. All right, moving on. No spoilers. All right, let's see what we got here, guys. Ooh, this, one's, this one feels hefty. It's kind of heavy. All right take a look where's our back there it is show you guys over here all right oh cool oh this is one of the grails awesome a 500 piece Freddy Funko glow in the dark this is rad from comic-con uh, San Diego 2018 this one's really rad it's from the uh, fun days 2018 convention exclusive so this one's rad this is box number I think that's seven looks like a seven or maybe it's a six I don't know, you guys be the judge. Tell me in the comments, do you think it's a 7 or do you think it's a 6? Either way, pretty cool. Yeah, this is one of the grails on the list, uh, so I'm pretty excited about this. As you guys know, I'm not a huge Freddy Funko uh, collector, but I kind of like the way this one looks. Cool little 8-bit situation, no wonder it's so heavy. Man, this thing is, it's got some, some weight to it there. 
Uh, but this is the second Freddy Funko that I've ever uh, gotten. And it's this one's pretty rad. I want to check out the glow on this. So, uh, you know what I think we'll do? Uh, let's add in a little photo right now where we check out the glow. So, this is what it looks like. Alright, pretty cool one, right guys? Not too mad about this. Once again, it is Freddy Funko. The, uh, what do you call this? 8-bit. 500 piece from uh, San Diego Comic Con 2018. Last one. I think we already had our big victory. Trash. Uh, I think we already had our big victory, but, you know, we don't stop till the end, guys. Keep this party going. All day, every day. So here we go. We're going to open up this last one. Here's our two. Nope, that's our bottom. There's the front. Here's the back. What do we got here? All right, we got Gold Gamora from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. This is out of box number 95. Uh, I'm not a huge Guardians of the Galaxy fan. I did end up watching this movie with my family on Christmas, though. So, I mean, it was pretty funny, pretty good. Uh, the only gold um, Marvel one that I have so far is uh, Black Panther. So this one, we might keep in the collection. I'm not sure, but if somebody needs it, hit me up. I'm sure we can work something out if this is something you're really looking to add to the collection. Um, this one's pretty cool. I mean, I always like the gold chrome. Uh, I always think the, the shine on it's pretty cool. And I like the little gold accents that they throw on the boxes for these ones with the uh, Marvel the first 10 years. So uh, why don't we take a look at everything that we got, guys, and let's get you some values. All right, guys, so I would say that this is a win. Right here, Betty Boop and uh, Pudgy, I think is how we're supposed to pronounce it, is $8 on Pop Price Guide and the uh, Funko app right now. Once again, Entertainment Earth exclusive, $8. This right here, Venomized Captain America from the Venomized Marvel Collection uh, is sitting right at $7 right now on the Funko app. Gamora, the Chrome Edition, Gold Chrome from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 is sitting at $7 on the Funko app right now. And the big win, the big victory, the holy grail of them all. Freddy Funko, 500 piece, from San Diego Comic Con, 2018. $80. Whoop, whoop! Big win, guys. So we spent about $48 on the whole thing. Uh, and so, I mean, right here, this already takes care of that and more. Definitely not mad about it. I mean, cool piece. I'm not sure if it'll stay in the collection if I can find something to trade that is, uh, just as cool, then maybe I'd consider it. But for right now, this one's gonna go right next to the other Freddy Funko that I have, uh, that I got in another Poptopia mystery box. So, uh, tell me guys, what do you think? Did we get uh, an ultimate victory on this one? I would say we did, but let me know what you think. Uh, shoot me a comment below. Let me know what you've been pulling out of your mystery boxes, and let me know what you think about all these. What's the sleeper in this? What's the one that I'm missing out on that I'm not as excited about that I should be excited for? And always tell me what you guys are picking up. I want to hear where you're picking up mystery boxes from because I'm looking for new places. And always shout out to my friends in the Funko Collector Society. And uh, make sure you subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Left Coast Pops. Uh, hit the little subscribe button. Hit the bell so you can see this beautiful face on your feed as much as possible. And we will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for the support. Love y'all. See you soon. Peace.